guys a little added bonus supplies to my last video that I posted. And that was like our school supplies and some things that I got um, for the kids to be able to have when school starts. But my sister-in-law recently bought these little toy things called Plus Plus. And you can make like certain characters and stuff with them. And they're all all different. I think it comes with like certain instructions on how to make them. So my other kids wanted to have some of that. So I never went to this store before. It's in our nearby like town where we live. And I wanted to just go there and get a couple things like this or I wanted to try to get like a bigger pack for them guys to play with so they can share with them. Um, there's not, let me see how many pieces are in here. There's 70 pieces in here and then there is 240 in the big ones. And you can go on Amazon I think and purchase some of these. She had these at a pretty good reasonable price. Um, so we got a package of that and some of the kids got some extra ones with their own money and this is something that they picked out. It also comes with um, some like bases that they can create and do things off of. They also have bigger sets than this. I think on Amazon, I kind of went on there to look at the prices difference. And they also have uh, different colors. These are more like neon colors and the this just comes with the kit so they kind of fit towards whatever kit you might be able to get one what was yours oh no whose is this one down there miles. oh miles got a uh, give me the instruction instruction and then he's able to make little guys or something with them so miles is blue gray and white give me one of his little characters ones yeah. And yellow. Can I have one of them? And something else? How about the yellow and white one? Okay. Or are they all the same thing? That's a house? Yeah. How is that a house? Because you live in a house. And, and that golden one is mm -hmm. uh, twins. No, whips. Some of the kids put together some of these. This is Miles's kit that he picked out for him. Another thing, I think a lot of people have seen this. Let's see if I can. Another thing that they she had there, um, I think Kohl's sells these and Amazon sells these. And they are the water, water books. So you just add water into the brush and then the picture appears when they color it. So I got that for Evelyn. Evelyn. So when we start school that she'll have something to play with. I also got her something else. But I'm gonna show you something off of these. So these are really tiny pieces, uh, ages five to 12. And then, what are these, does it say? It's probably still the same age, I think. Um, I don't know. So these- It is the same age. Uh, yeah, probably, huh? Those are the same size. Okay, so they're really, really tiny. They also have, and we'll show you this one in a little bit because the kids are gonna play, you guys are gonna play with this or you can play with this stuff. That's a, okay, they've been waiting for me to show you because I wanted to do this video first before I let them play with it, just so it's not like all tore apart. Also have a bigger size kit and then they're able to um, follow like a template on how to build it. So these come in, come with like templates and stuff. These aren't going to be, these are gonna be more like a flat design unless she wants to uh, do her own thing with these, but they're pretty big compared to like how tiny these pieces are. So this is ages, what's it say? Three to seven on here. The twins will probably play with this when we do school. 
So I'm gonna pull this out because I wanna show you guys how it looks. So it gives you a bunch of different templates that you can follow. Uh, let's see. So with these, you just find the shapes and then fit it in there. So all it is is this shape right here. There's no other shapes. And then you would put one this way and one this way and make it a like butterfly. And then they have another side. So that's what you do with that. It says seven puzzle cards inside and then it's the 60 piece set. Holy. These are big. These are bigger than I thought. And do these do these feel the same? No. Than them? I mean, I know they're not going to be as maybe squishy, but the same maybe material. Mm -hmm. What is those? These are the bigger size. What? For kids. Which you actually pour out? No, I'm going to do cool. this on Where'd here. Where did you get this? At that day, this was for little kids. Hi. <laughs> Standing right there. I need okay. something. Oh. So he could just kind of put stuff together so they just kind of come out pieces like that. I just want to show them quick how, let's see if I can. So, like, this piece would go here. And then you would turn this one sideways to fit there, and then you would uh, continue and then do the picture. Evelyn might not be able to do the pictures, but Declan will be able, to, or Declan and the twins will be able to do these. Um, but Evelyn will be able to like interlock and um, put them together, so she can do stuff like that. She'll have fun with that. I like to get different things every year for homeschool because um, each kid is at different ages and di I have to work around different age groups when I'm homeschooling. And this year, last year we did seven kids, this year we're doing seven, now Evelyn's a little older, so she's a little bit more into things than last year. So I'm hoping that we can kind of keep her busy with stuff like this. I am going to um, show you something else that I got for Evelyn. And then I will show you some of the stuff that they that they have. Um, another thing I got there is a magnet discovery kit. It's for ages one to five, 18 pieces. We have a lot of magnets here. We do all sorts of different size magnets. And then on the back, it uh, shows you different animals and how to connect them. So she'll have fun with that. And I probably will only pull, the, pull these out when uh, she, when we're doing school. And then it just comes with a book with other magnets. They had um, the bigger kit magnet ball sets there. I just didn't get that. This is a little bit, here, let me show you something. These we have already with some magnet balls. So we might just include all this together with the other ones that we have. But with these. Well, I made one of the things. Oh yeah. Here, what, a butterfly? A bee. Oh, a bee. A little bumblebee. Um, so with this, you have the front part and a magnet, there's a magnet inside and then you can put the body part together. So it doesn't, it holds pretty good. Um, and let's see. Yeah, it doesn't fall apart very easily. So then she can just make a couple characters. Comes with an elephant, a rhino, the other ones, alligator, crocodile. Let's see. Oh, I think this. Oh my god. Um, a giraffe, tiger or lion, and a hippo. I will. Hudson had a turtle. They have a lot of puppets there, so he got a. Pup. They like doing animals. Yeah. I got a two pack. 
So she would just connect them together and they'll stand up like that. So, so that I have the video. I think that one will probably go up before this one with some of the stuff that I will be using only during homeschool for Evelyn. I will pull that stuff out only at the time. Um, I know with us, with some of our toys, I like to, if you guys watch my cleaning video of Evelyn's room, I try to put things away and then pull them out when I need them, just to make it a little bit more exciting for them. When I was there, I saw um, these and I think she's gonna like it. So this is gonna get put away for the day that I really need to have her sit and concentrate. I'll pull this stuff out. Um, yeah, well that does. Bacon and eggs. Oh, that's what that is. Bacon oh, eggs. so you're just using. And yeah. so here's bacon. That's probably the frying pan, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That part. So here are the eggs that he just built, and here's the bacon. <laughs> that's really funny. Okay. So why don't you guys put this away now, and then I can show him the other stuff. Okay. So I showed you guys this and then they have the bases and stuff that they can build things off of. Um, whose is this one? Yeah, that's Declan's. Oh, okay, give that to Declan. So this is the one that Declan got for his birthday. And this is, um, I told my sister-in-law that it's her fault that I went to this store. I The store has been here for like, many years and I've never got a chance to go there. And now that I was able to go there and see how reasonable price everything is, I also think that some of this is gonna be used for like, or get some extra stuff for maybe like Christmas or something like that. We'll get some more of these. 10 bucks. I'll see how much they are on. When they show you different scenes and stuff. Here. Oh. Get in there, get in there. I'm saving the one that they want to do for last. Um, when another thing that I saw there and she was the lady there was telling me about is this one right here and I'll talk about that after. But when I was looking around, I saw these little individual putties there. They're called Crazy Errands, uh, Thinking Putty. This is Megawatt, Mini, Neon. So when you open them up, that's what it looks like. And then they actually seem a little thicker. Um, it's not like slime. I know she was thinking that it was more like yeah. slime. It's a putty. 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 My kids call putty, putty. So they're like really grippy. So I'll like pull this stuff out too, the days that we homeschool and they can um, play with that. So they all come in like different colors. How come that one didn't have a cover on? So it has a little, his little face on there, the little guy's face. This one is Neon Flash that I just showed you. Uh, now I forgot which one I did. I did that one. Yeah. This one is Radical Red. They all come with like a little cover on it. Here, let me <laughs> see if I can. There. How many ounces is it? They're really tiny. There's big ones. Did they have bigger ones? Yeah. This is like 13 grams or something like that. So you can get bigger ones, but I just wanted them to have little ones for them to play with. And then Cool Cobalt. And that's what the blue one looks like. Is this one yours? Yeah. Oh, that's Eli's. And got a green one. They have other colors there. I just didn't get all of them. And then they also have um, different, I think they have like smells and maybe, do they have magnet? I don't think it looks. Maybe. Magnetic ones. Actually, there is like different, like bigger ones that you can get, and some of them are magnetic, some glow in the dark. She was telling me to get this Mad Matter because I was kind of looking around and looking at all like the little areas that she had there. Give me one of the kinetic sand things. Okay, we are always. 
We're always trying to use like different things. This is something that I just got at Walmart and that's that kinetic sand. So it's squishy, but it also falls apart in pieces. And this stuff is not supposed to. So I'm gonna show you that. And they're, they're waiting for this big pack over here to play with. So we'll get to that last. But this is gonna be the same as that, it's the same thing. So this one is Galaxy. Um, make your Mad Matter sparkle. So these have a, like a little, they have glitter, and then they have a little form in here that they can uh, use. It says, never dries out, easy to shape and mold. The kinetic sand and this other stuff that we have back there, monkey foam. I think I did a, I did a video yeah. on monkey foam. And that, um, that's a little bit more stickier than some of the other stuff. So even with this putty, this isn't uh, very sticky. It, it's just, you know, you can mold and stuff. Yeah, but, I've seen that trying before. Yeah, so we're always into this kind of stuff more than some other stuff. We have Legos and other like creative stuff. But for me, for a school this year, this will be nice to um, do this. And I think I paid for the putty, they're $2.99. For this one, I think it was 24 something. I think it was 24, but maybe on Amazon, the pricing will be different. And then the one for Evelyn with the little magnetics, I think we're 24 too. Let's see what else. Um, yeah, $24.99. These were, this is $14.99 and this toolkit is, um, 30. So this one was a little bit more, but I don't know how much foam is in there or what is it even? It's like, it's kind of like the kinetic sand, except it's like, yeah, like softer. Yeah, it like stays together. Like moon doll. Yeah, like moon doll. Moon doll, it, yeah, we don't have moon doll, but that's, um, moon doll. Okay. So this is the form that it comes in. So it's pretty big. <laughs> Oh, here's a little knife. And you can just use your like Play-Doh stuff. Comes in purple and blue, and then it has glitter to add with it. So I'm not gonna pull this one apart, but we'll pull this uh, toolbox apart. So I will talk to you about that. And maybe in some of my homeschool videos, you'll see the kids play with stuff. Um, just because I'll need to probably help some of the big kids out and have the little kids play with something while I do that. All right, so let's talk about what is in here. Um, this one comes with 20 brick building tools and if you can see it has you can make like houses and then here's all your tools and i'm guessing these oh available oh it says available in six colors but this one is the red and blue colors press it mold it squish it sculpt it and build it and let's see so this is like a 10 ounce so if you guys are looking it up, it has 10 ounces, it says in there. And this is the toolbox construct, construction kit. So I don't know if they have other stuff than like this. Um, I know that they have a Galaxy, but we'll see. Normal toolbox. Just put the stuff, it's showing up yellow on the screen, but it's actually orange. So you can put stuff in there. Um, and, oh, this is like a, you put something in there and I was going to say, yeah, it's like shapes. a drill. If you put dough into uh, that. Yep. And oh, then and you, then it makes a brick. Yeah, and then you would squish it down and yep. then you would. Okay, so that's what it does. Makes it makes brick. little bricks. Okay, so that's that one. We got another little knife. There's <laughs> that, and we have two knives, so I'll, well, um, and then it gives you instructions on how to make some of the stuff. So you, there's probably a cutter in there, and then they make the bricks. 
Oh, that's almost similar to that little bear that we have. Okay. Guys, well, and we'll show you guys how. Oh, I'm just this. I don't care. Here, you guys can figure out these pieces. Ooh. Um, Eli, you want to put this together and see if that's like a brick thing that needs to be put together. Uh, Hudson, see what this is. I'm not sure. I wonder. Um. And then I'll just store everything back in this kit. And I have an area behind this curtain that I try to store some oh, things. Oh, different bits. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's, oh, that's cool. So I'm this one to... is going to be a different design. Um, I was showing you guys in what video is that going to be? Um, I think my school supply one, not Evelyn's, but my school supply one. That we're going to be doing something different over here behind uh, Nash and Lachlan. So I might be able to have cubbies over here to do, um, but we'll see. I'm not sure how I'm gonna be able to set things up, if I can even keep things out. I try to keep, put things somewhere where, um, like Evelyn or the little ones. So this is kind of like our first year that we don't have extreme little ones or a baby or a one-year-old. So things are starting, I mean, besides like dealing with it. <laughs> So we're still gonna have to deal with Evelyn, but it's not like having a one-year-old. And with Evelyn, we can take her outside or maybe do a school outside for a couple of times. Whatever it takes to um, do what it, what is it? You put some dough in. And then oh, and then you squeeze it. it. Okay, so did you have to put this? Oh, it just goes like that. Bend it. Oh, so these little pieces have different uh, designs right here, little textures. And this has little textures, so you fold, oh, fold them in like this, and then it makes a brick, and they can connect it. We'll show you guys. So we're just going to get everything ready and organized, and maybe eventually I can buy bigger packets or just the dough stuff, and it'll be cheaper just to get the dough stuff than all the kits. You do it like this because and I don't always have to like go to the store. I can go on Amazon too, but with it being a local store, I'd rather try that out. And I don't know how you guys feel about when kids play with Play-Doh play and mixing it together. When our kids were little, me and my husband, if we let our kids play with Play-Doh, um, we had to kind of sit next to them because we didn't want them to mix it. Do you remember that when you guys were little? <laughs> when you guys were little, we was to sit next to you guys because we didn't want you to mix this brand new Play-Doh together. Do you remember? I don't know if you remember. So my sister would let her kids play with Play-Doh and she didn't care that they were mixed. And I had a really hard time with that because I didn't want our Play-Doh mixed together. Now I could care less as long as they're having fun I don't really care. Actually, sometimes I'll buy a bunch of Play-Doh and we have to end up throwing it away because it ends up on the floor right away. But um, with this, I don't really care if it's mixed. That's just gonna be something that they're gonna have to, you know, kind of work through. Or, all right, so what? what is that one? What are them little things? Are they templates? Declan's, or Hudson's gonna try to figure this out for us, okay? But I'm gonna show them what to do. Okay, so I'm gonna take this, put this in here. Does it matter like how big of stuff? Oh, okay, so I'm just gonna do it. So you squish it like this. Let's see, Let's see what's gonna happen here. Ooh, so I did it. So that's what it looks like, and then it has it that on the not. side. So that's pretty cool. I creased it. Oh yeah, let me show him. So this is what his looked like. And then when you, can I ruin it? Can I ruin it? Yeah. Okay, so then it just squishes back. Now it pulls in pieces and like a couple pieces might go to the floor, but it's not like just now. But you, can but you can just pick it up. It's not sandy or gritty. I know some kinetic sand in the past used to be kind of gritty. And if it fell to the floor, it was kind of sandy. Yeah. But this is very soft and it's almost velvety, right? It's almost like a soft 
paper feeling. Here, I'll put this down so you guys can see. Eli's right over here and he's gonna show you guys some stuff too. Where's the Let me see what that, Wait, oh, that's not even it. Oh, weird. And then you oh, I know. I know. It's like so like, it's so like, Mm -hmm. Yeah, that. Yeah. Isn't it kind of velvety? It's soft and like squish it. Does it go back to its shape? No, it like stays no, it and falls shape. apart. And that one is... Whose is this one? Mine. Oh, Declan wants me to share with you this one. What? Where's the cover? Uh, I took out the video? Oh, yeah, I'm not done yet. I mean, I gotta edit everything. But he, Declan, got this color. I think it was what was it, lava or no? Fire, 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 something, whatever. So they have all different names. Turtle for, fire. It's not turtle fire. But internal. Yeah. Oh, let me see. We have this little bear form that we use for Play-Doh and stuff. So he just made a little, a little bear. Oh, it's cute. Hopefully you guys liked today's video. Um, don't forget to subscribe so you guys don't miss out on the rest of the month of September because we're going to have a lot of homeschool videos. Um, some informational, some fun, some daily stuff with the kids and some of the things that we're going to do this year and some things that we're going to do different. I have a lot of different ideas for this month with homeschool and videos. So that's going to be fun. Um, the kids are just going to sit here and continue to play with that stuff. And I need to tackle my homeschool stuff. So we're getting ready here and um, going to start hopefully this week. We're waiting on a couple things to come in the mail for us to get started. But otherwise, I have a fun day coming up, hopefully, for um, one of the days with us homeschooling. So come back and watch that because this video will be first before that video. So you guys will have a little update on some of the things that are coming. I just don't want to share a lot of stuff because some things are going to be fun and interesting. And um, some of it is just... Uh, me sharing some information so hopefully you guys like today's video